Thank you so much for joining me in this game edge. We're testing out Invasion 2037, a brand new game on Steam. And yes, before you say anything, this is available in first person or third person. I'll show you how to do that. Let's go to the story. We've been invaded by, I guess, aliens and robots. I'm not exactly sure, but they've actually attacked the planet. And now everybody is turning to mutants, zombies, whatever you want to call them. And we need to find a cure for it. We're in a shelter here, a little bunker. And we need to make sure we keep like things like this, the generator going. If you guys see, we need to keep that fuel going or else we'll lose out. It also help us out for improvements in our lab because we need to find a cure. We're scientists now. You can actually customize your character a tiny bit. I'm just going to show you this. There's a little bit of clipping in here uh, through this, if you guys are seeing. But that's, again, for early access, so please overlook that. I try to play with the settings and stuff, but I can't figure out what it is, uh, why it's causing that. All right, let's go over here, press F. And you can uh, switch out if you want to with F key. I don't think you need to do it. <laughs> you don't need to run over there and do it. Uh, but you can actually press F right here and boom. Uh, we can switch anytime you want to. So you can mess around with that. We've got the crafting menu here. We can actually do a little bit of crafting early on. I think there'll be improvements and stuff as we go through this. Again, this is experimental. This part, the first person. So that was, if you guys want to play it, you got to be aware of it. Like the wobbling back and forth. I think that's something they'll have to work on. Uh, his head movement. I think it's just following it right now currently. So yeah, that'll be something to watch out for. Okay, let's go and jump in here and see crafting. Uh, can we do anything with the crafting? Yeah, press E. Let's jump into this mask filter so far we can make. And you needed uh, some charcoal, some cloth, and some plastics. Takes five seconds to make. And it makes sense. It's a mask filter itself. All right, nice. And there we go. Percentage of health. So we have some badges and ventilation filters, which we'll need. Also, it tells you all the things right there on the bottom. Very, very cool. We also have repairs and stuff from like body armor. People have asked for that for a while. That looks pretty darn cool. All right. They've asked us to go and check out on top. You see, grab your mask and locker. We'll be doing that. Info. This is the only place that you can save your progress. Ooh. The only place? Holy shite, dude. That's pretty crazy. All right. Um, grab your mask and locker. Right, I'm going to grab my body armor too, dude. Because, you know, I, I'm thinking body armor is going to be something important. Reduces 33% damage. Pretty cool. We're going up there, though, very shortly. Very, very shortly. All right. Again, early access. Little things will be happening. No, we'll see the improvements. The developers seem to be really, really excited. Uh, again, about what they're putting together. Here. And I, so far, I like it. I'm going to do first person for uh, searching this, right? Just seems a little bit easier to grab. All right. Yeah, let's grab the gas mask. This sounds like a plan. All right. Something opened up. I guess it won't let us until we go. Uh, new objective here. Look at your lab for improvement fields. All right, let's go and look at your lab. There's also a filter right here. What? Ventilation. Wow. All right, we have to repair shit too. Okay, info. The lab will give you access to improvements in fields, researches, bunkers, and survival. Nice. Let's see what that looks like when we get close. Yep. So we got researches here. And currently. All right, we got vaccine researches. I guess we're going to need samples. All right, can't wait to find out how that's going to work out. I guess as we go out and about, maybe we'll find some samples out there. I'm liking the way this is running so far. I mean, I'm liking the idea of this game. Uh, unlock the level two. All right, there's some more here. Bunker. And, all right, requirements, hardware, and rations. Uh, let's start. Yeah, we need those things. All right, cool. So we'll be looking out for some rations, 15 of them, and we also need hardware. Hopefully, we can have a big enough backpack for that. That'd be pretty darn cool. And we also have survival. And lock here, vitality. And stuff like this. I don't think we again we need these to start upgrading a lot. We'll we'll go out there and look at all those cool things. Very, very nice so far. I'm liking that there's a little bit of research. Uh, definitely a different style of uh menu there, but I'm, I'm not hating it. I'm not hating it. All right, I guess we have to go outside. That's what they want me to do. Uh find a new filter for your mask. All right, do I have one? Storage. All right, we have actually storage in here. You know, I'm not hating this mat this this menu, it's very nice. It's uh, different than I've seen a lot, not the regular everyday kind of thing. It's cool. Uh, weapons menu, too. All right, we got nothing. You also can get mines. That could be interesting. I can see some shoddy, 7.62, some shoddy. Okay, that's pretty cool. And on bottom here, we got a little bit of 30 seconds or 30 minutes, I guess. Maybe 30 minutes of time. And we also are standing on the bottom left, our health in our armor. All right. I don't think we can find anything else. Is there anything else in these uh, things? Or are we going to go outside and look for one of these filters? Because I can't craft anything. I don't have anything in the, inside my inventory, which is tab, by the way. And I wonder if I'm going to get more inventory space than that. That is really shitty. Hopefully, we'll find some. All right, let's go out there. Okay, we just got out. We're going to look for a mask, a filter. And see it's in red on the bottom there. We'll have to start looking around for this. 
All right, let's do this really quick. Open this up, baby. All right, all right, more, all right, bigger backpack. Oh, nice. All right, an extra two rows, I'll take that. Thank you, dude. Love you, car. Love you. What do we have, some spray can pan? Rubbing alcohol, all right, good. Abused, and abused, we can use that. Some cloth, I guess we could go back down and make our own filter, if we don't find anything here. Some metal, not hating the first person view. I mean, again, you can swap over, and maybe get a better angle if you want to. What is that? Oh, it's just a but shit. I swear to God, I thought it was something walking there. All right, a radio. Interesting thing to find. Don't exactly know how to use that. Some metal. It was might be the alien sounds. There's a, like some kind of big robot from what I've seen in the previews. It looked really cool. Reason why I wanted to play it. I get it first person, like they mentioned, it's still experimental. It's cool that they're getting out there with that. Most of the games will say, no, not do it. Or they do one or the other. I like the option. It gives every player the way they want to play. You know what I'm saying? I know it's a lot of work for devs and stuff, but uh, yeah, I'm cool with that. I'm definitely cool. Liking the vibe so far. All right, here we go. Headlamp. Press H for headlamp. All right. That's not so bad. Not sure how long the batteries last. Yeah, we'll turn off the battery. It's pretty well lit already. Grab some of those. Batteries plus one. All right, can I lock this? I need some kind of crowbar. No, it's just open. That brings us back outside. It's some kind of horse over there, I think. Eh? Yeah, the poor horses. Okay, you see, like, that's the thing. His head's still bobbing around, which I think if you're in first person, he'll follow you a little better. Is that possible? Is I'm moving around? Yeah. I don't know. A little bit of both. I mean, I don't know how funny it's going to be. Take a little bit of each, right? So we can show everybody a little bit of each and every one of these. As long as you're patient, remember, early access. Patience is always nice. All right. There's a car. Anything here we can use? Some more cloth and stuff. I think we're going to have to go and craft it up ourselves. You can repel enemies by kicking. Uh, kick. Ah. Oh, sorry, horse. Shit, dude. I really was sorry. All right, so flashlight is at 89 already. Just don't, don't play with that. I think there's a second floor to this. I didn't go and check that out. Oh, we're finding a crap load of cloth. That's pretty good. And some more batteries. I don't know how to replace that. Oh, it's charcoal. Okay, so I think we can go and craft this up. Some hardware. Some more hardware. Do I go and drop this off inside the, the bunker first and then come back out? Because, I mean, if I'm not finding a filter... Unless I found it, I didn't see it. Now I'm not seeing it. Can we move this around in here? We can. Nice. Is that a filter or what is that? Battery. Okay. So it looks a little different than battery for me, but I, I get it now. Now I've seen it, I, I'll, I'll keep track of that. I'm liking this like War of the Worlds kind of feel to this game. I don't know what it is. It really has this feel to it. I think I have to go make myself my own filter here, dudes and dads. Um, I'm going to check out this house. Oh, we got to be careful for, for a stam too. We still got like a couple of minutes left, so before we do that, let's make this as valuable as possible. I'm going to check out as much loot as we can. Grab. Maybe make a couple of filters because I want to watch out my time frame. Oh, a little knife. Is that like useful for weapons? We consider that a weapon or not? Weapons menu. No, that's not considered a menu. That's, I mean, a weapon. That's kind of different. You think the knife was a, a weapon, but I guess up close and personal is not as good. I'm not seeing it here. Hardware? Alien hardware. Hardware. Hmm. All right. I feel like I'm going blind here. There is no knife being used here. Okay. Just making sure. Just making sure I'm not going crazy. I'm going to grab a couple of things here. All right, we'll switch over to the first person here just to look around. Hopefully there's nothing around here. Oh, that dude doesn't look like he... Oh, he didn't make it. Ah, oh, good. We found a filter. Don't set off anything weird, guys, please. Uh, go to Henry's house. All right, uh, but shouldn't I go and drop some of his shit off? I'm just saying, because it looks like there's some food and some stuff we can utilize all here before I go and see Henry. You know what I'm saying? I want to go and check out a bunch of stuff here. Another bag. Increase my size now. What's this? 
Union Hill County map. All right, press M for map. Cool, that's where you find a map. All right, we actually all good. We can actually see us <laughs> as a player. I find out. Oh, I don't like that at all. Red X. A whole bunch of houses here. And they want us to go where? That direction. Which is just up the hill from here. It's not far away. Actually, it's really not far away. But if we're going to go out that far, I'm going to like to drop off some stuff here. Especially that I'm a looter kind of guy. You know what I'm talking about. Oh. Screw jar. Gotcha. All right, I'm already liking the feel of this game. I'll be honest with you. So the knife is a uh, hardware. Gotcha. Okay, okay, okay. Now you guys get into the feels. Tell me you prefer seeing third person, first person. Um, I don't know. We're going to go back and forth on these. All right, we'll go back and forth and really check it all out. I think grabbing shit's going to be a lot easier in a first person, though. But we'll test it out. I mean, I haven't really given it a good, fair try. Some more charcoal so we can make more filters and other things. Okay, okay. I don't like that. I didn't do a second floor yet. I don't look like anything else in the car either. Well, these are very narrow ass rooms, man. I lived in a house like this once when I was young. I right, definitely first person when we we're doing this because I can't see anything around those rooms. Again, appreciating the developers doing this first person and third person view. Yeah. And there's no options to, I mean, motion blur, turn it off. It's when you start playing this game, motion blur is turned on. Last bottle empty. Now we're really grabbing a lot of loot. We're going to have to go back down first and do a little drop off. And maybe make yourself a couple of filters. We only have 24 minutes on this filter. We'll have to keep the filter we have on us and maybe grab another one, make another one. We'll do a crafting. I mean, we've got to try our best, right? All right, some more hardware. Interesting. We need to collect as much as possible that. That guy's completely foobard. A whole bunch of body bags. I don't even call it body bags. It looks like hefty bags of bodies in it. Okay. All right, let's get going. I seem like a guy around. I don't know. Yeah, the wobbling of the head has to stop. That's one thing I have to say. <laughs> That's one thing that I couldn't take. Is a wobbling of the head there for a bit. All right, some plastics. I'm going to Henry's house when I want to go to Henry's house. Don't you dare tell me where to go. Just joking. All right, well, we have to remember where we, we have to stay, too, because if we jump in here, we'll have to make sure we know exactly where we're staying. All right, we're back in. All right, let's open this up and just drop off some stuff. Okay, it doesn't take a shite load of room, does it? I want to try out the crafting a tiny bit. I want to really kick the tires on this one a bit. And let's see here. Let's make another filter. And there you go. Very nice. It just goes over that side. Maybe make one of the badges. And ventilation filter. That's going to be later on, I guess. Let's add yeah, it's a little more ventilation. All right, cool. Maybe it's for this ventilator here. This one here. We'll have to watch. Oh, yeah. Look at the bars going down. Shit, we're going to have to watch out for that. Gotcha. All right. Let's open this up and see. We got a couple of filters we need to keep. This stuff, metal and stuff, we can put back. I take charcoal. This we need to keep. The map stays on us like that. Okay. And badges. The rest of the stuff. Yeah. We'll put it back in here. Now, does he have a shift click? Oh, he has shift click. All right. Give these devs a uh, round of applause. That's very rare for most devs when they first start off doing this. Someone has played a game and realized shift click is important. Oh, I like this scene right there. Look at that. You look freaking awesome, dude. All right, let's go to Henry's house. I have no weapon. We'll have to watch out for a stamina. And like I mentioned, and I've seen in previews, you can, and they did say, you can find and fix up cars. And you'll have to manage your... Oh, good, we can jump over that. Uh, you could yet to manage your stuff, so you'll have to manage your uh, gas, and I guess, repairs. We're also going to be very careful about one thing is that I don't really want to get into a big fight with any of these zombies right now. We don't have any weapons thinking it's not a good idea. We're going to play it down low. Now, is there a sneak? Oh, there's a little bit of sneak there. All right. Let's just grab this stuff. Sure, another empty bottle. Maybe some Molotov. Maybe grab some fuel from somewhere. Since we don't see a jerry can or anything. Could be further out, too. This looks like more of a tutorial-style start to this. 
Just gonna double check the outskirts. Yeah, nothing. Oh, look at what's this? Some cereal. Man, I hope it's alpha. Alphabets. Remember those alphabets? Those were used to be good. Mm -mm -mm. What's your favorite cereal? You guys have to tell me in the comment fields. Honeycombs are always freaking awesome too. What the hell is up with that? Did you see it? Look at the uh the little shadowing effect there. So I guess something the developers will have to work on. Or maybe it's a little bit of eerie. I don't know. Looks pretty cool though. Okay, we got that, we got that. Is that a lantern? Can we grab that? Oh shit, sorry. No, no. Let's try a little first person. Oh crap. Well, Henry didn't make it. Alright, let's just get off here so I stop wobbling. Alright, select a range weapon. Press one to equip with via melee weapon. Press three. Uh, switch for weapons. Press Q. Melee attacks. Alright, left and right. Oh crap. As soon as this you know what? As soon as I grab that stupid crowbar, you know what's gonna happen? Shit's gonna come flying out at me, I bet you. It's tutorial style. I mean, I've been through this enough. If I'm wrong, then so be it. But at least I was safety first. Right? We want to make sure safety is there. I think we went around everywhere. I just want to make sure I grab, like, every little piece. I don't think I think it's like that when I'm running around with my head cut off. All right. So, hurry. Sorry, Henry. I appreciate your, uh, you giving me that. No, I was wrong. All right. Oh, no, I was. I told you. Damn it. I knew it. I knew this shit was going to happen. The hell, I'm trying to do the other thing. Some kind of sample or something. What does that say, sample? Oh shit, dude. Some kind of like foreskin sample, was it? <laughs> Effective sample. Detection sample game. It's just like a hand. Sorry for kicking around. Okay, so the right click gives you some mega hits. All right, I need to go to a convenience store now. How much room do I have? I don't have a ton of room, but we have a little bit of food and stuff, which I'm not sure if that's going to be very handy or not, but I guess it's going to be. We try at the convenience store. Maybe we'll find something better, but this curl bar doesn't seem so bad. Does it have a, a quality currently? It may not be right now. I don't see a quality on there, right? So if you guys are asking, no quality so far. All right, so we're going to be running through. Oh, Jesus, no, I don't want to run through that. We're going to run a little bit higher and see what this church has to offer before we head out there. Especially the only place I can save. We like we missed a whole bunch of houses. I don't know why we're not spending more time with these houses. It seems like the first place I want to go. And I wonder if the developers will expand the map a tiny bit. I mean, it looks big, but I'm, I'm thinking this is just a start of it. Man, this cemetery, I guess... Probably not a good place to go, Gamage. Why are you going to a cemetery? That's the last place. Okay, no. Just a church. There's just heavy Zs there. We're, we're walking. Yeah, there's, a, there's one. Yeah, ha, to you too. Make sure you got your stamina before you go. Ha, dude. Oh, yeah. So that second hit. You got to, like, not mash it. We got time it just right. Pick up the foreskin. Oh, dude. Oh, that's some smacking good fun. <laughs> the sounds are funny. It's cute. I got you. I got your mom's foreskin. Sorry, dude. <laughs> Was that a young kid? You don't see that very often in games anymore. A mine. Crap, don't just pick it up, man. And make sure it's all safe. I know it's telling me where it's supposed to go, but I'm curious. I also want to mess around now in first person see it's harder oh, it's a little tough tough to get that second swing in. and uh, look at that some foreskin right there I'm just joking around it's like a toaster a yeah, toaster's gotta be handy let's clear up the disease from out here we'll get a little bit of experience pick up what we can from this my oh there we go Oh shit, it's real. Alright. I gotcha. Let me just grab the that there we go. 
Now, that's what we were supposed to bring back, I think, for researching. We're going to need a whole lot, though, so... Where is she? Where the hell is she coming from? Oh, little kid. Or a teenager. No. He's not really uh, there anymore, right? So, in fact, it's really not what it looks like. Could just be a very short man, too. I don't see a way in there on back, so we're just going to go here. I guess we are going to check it out. What's this? A hammer. If I had a hammer. Can I open this up? Doesn't look like I can open it up right now. Church is closed. Well, at least that part is. It's pretty darn cool, this game so far. And I can only imagine it's going to bolster up. And how many, where's our freaking door in this place? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry for kicking your ass around. Oh, there's some stuff here. Yeah, I'll take that cloth, dude. I don't know if the filter swaps up by itself. I'm curious. That door is very small and also very locked right now. I don't know if it makes sense to size. Oh, yeah, it does. It's maybe I'm just taller than most of these people. Okay, how much stuff do I have on me? It is a lot of stuff. So this gives you 25 health right now. The cereal will give you 15 health. A little bit of cloth and stuff. So far, I've taken not much damage. Not much, actually. You can't craft on a flyer. I really, really need the crafting table. All right. I gotta remember where we're at, though. We have to, This is our bunker, I guess. The green thing there. Just make sure we remember. Very important. What's these arrows here? It looks like a lab up there. And they want us to go over here. Oh, crap. We have to do it. Let's go to one more. Is that a mine? No, it's just a rock. I had to make sure. So, anyways, that little skull part, it's telling us not to go there. It's pretty much obvious that we shouldn't be going there. But again, what would be fun if we don't at least explore and see what they have to offer, right? Why is that XE part? <laughs> XE, we're going to call it the XE part. A skull and bones. Why are you putting skull and bones? There are probably tons of Zs out here. And we're going to stay away from them. Oh, some kind of... Oh, okay. I thought it was a shelter. Actually, it's rock. Ultimate shelter. Yeah, we're heading right for it. We're not talking about chicken. No. We might be chicken when we run away from this area, but... All right. Try not to run too much, because I have a feeling I'll need every little bit of that stam you don't have right now to get my butt out of here. How far are we from this area? We should be right there. Take a look, just a little jog. Oh, shit, look at this. The big ass wall. What the frick? Why is this here? Is there any, like, some serious. <gasps> oh, my God. Now we know. Who the hell is shooting me like that? Other survivors? Bandits? Assholes, crap! All right. Well, I just jumped like ten feet. By the way, I was not expecting other living people to shoot me, but obviously, there is. All right. Well, time to take some Fruit Loops. Consume one. All right. We're gonna need some more. We have badges too, but you know, if we're gonna utilize this shit. Malzo just eat. Malzo will make sure he enjoys himself the time. There you go. We got one hundred percent health. Sure, we'll find more food in our way there. Son of a bitch, though. Damage our nice gear. All right, so skull and bones. Don't go. All right, it looks like a hell of a fight in there. But if we didn't do it, we would never know there was that killer of an area. That must be some serious loot in there. I don't know what the hell shot us either. There must be some kind of sentry out there somewhere. I didn't see him. Maybe he's posing as a tree. I don't know. All right, we got a little bit further away. Atmospherically, this is really cool. A lot of sounds of this game. Again, if you guys want to see more of this, take the time, hit the like button, get in the comment fields. Love to do a couple parts, if not a series on this. I don't know. It looks pretty cool to me. Looks really cool. I can swap back and forth. And also, good. Tell me. 
if you want to see it in first person or third person. It's going to be tough because I know it's going to be like a mix. I probably have to put a poll out. I think they need to work on a first person right now. Just a tiny bit. The head bobbing and stuff can get me a little bit dizzy. If you can stabilize that, then you got me. Yeah, we're going to take a little easy now. Um, look how cool we look. We look badass. <laughs> we do. I don't know if those checks are fixable or not. I do know that I saw the car look like a green muscle car. Oh, there's some freaking Z's in this area. Yeah, there's one Z right there. Unless you can drag her or it. I shouldn't say her. I like that thing when we turned around and we waved them. Yeah, just pretend she can't see. Yeah, let's just pretend it. How come it didn't work this time? Huh? What, what, why? You same one who cut me off last week? Yeah, well, it sucks to be you. Oh, I'm kicking around like nothing. Like you're feathery. You feathery person. How you doing? Oh, okay, that's a lot of one ball. Can I just go this direction, please, sir, first? Oh, uh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Okay, we'll space you guys out, I think. Oh, frick, there's more behind that guy. fun if you don't try and play it the way it's supposed to be played oh dude that was fun yeah i'm gonna be checking you out I, I figured we're gonna test this baby out and it is possible to take care of everybody not bad i only lost 20 health on it my pulper vest didn't take any pounding on it that's good that sounds awful when i said it recover well oh, revolver i thought i said recover revolver app loader but no revolver dude Maybe inside. Oh, I'm so freaking liking this game. I'm stoked. I'm going to have to do I hope you guys are going to like this too. I think. What was that? Oh, shit. Oh, it's objective. I thought I freaking set off a trap. <laughs> First thing you hear when you hear that sound, it's a trap about to explode. Another radio. I don't know if there's a time of day either. I don't know. Let's see any watches or anything. There's a lot of loot here. Some crackers on the ground. Some more stuff over here. Chicken soup. Come on. Mm mm. Good. Crossword. You've seen this crossword how many times? I missed. That crossword puzzle has made a fortune for someone. Some more bread over there. I'm just trying to see if there's anything back here. Anything back here? No. All right. Sorry if I zoomed back in and out there. I'm just testing out both to see. Got to have a little bit of fun testing, testing. Can't break this, right? That'd be too cool if we could. Did I break my tool? No. All right, cool. Can't swing on those, eh? Let's hope I can swing and break it. Looks like an accident next door, too. I'm just going to double check to see. They want to go back to some kind of high school and check that out. Oh, good. We got more friends. It's like some kind of garage or something. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You got early access. I don't know if they're going to keep that sound or not. Oh, that's the best sound ever right there, dude. It's only like a gas. That's wicked. Oh, there's that car I saw in a preview. We need to fix this baby up. Oh, look at this. Look at that ride, dude. Oh, yeah, look. He's looking back going, damn, that's smoking hot. Okay, so this is supposed to be a ride we can take. So it needs 80% right there. I think repair is left, right? So I'm not sure if it's a better than first person or we need some kind of skills for that. I'm not sure how that works out. Some fuel and something. We're missing something. For sure. I think it'll make us wait before we get it all done, right? I think that's how it works. Some rubbing alcohol. He built to rub himself a lot, dude. Lots of rubbing going to be going on. What do we have here? A oh, freaking eight, dude. We've got the car keys. Jazz. 
Tell me that car works, and I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna have a little tear in my eye, and then if it's gonna be like, it's gonna be a very heartfelt moment if this thing is working. Oh my god! Control. Oh my god, dude! This is super cool. Now we gotta be careful. We went around in things. We're gonna have some serious problems. Probably should go and check out to see if there's any fuel and stuff. That's pretty far away. It makes sense why that car is there. We'll turn this off. There's different gears. Oh, look, we have fire brake. Could I press it? <laughs> That's epic. Oh, man. That's the coolest thing I've seen in this game. In a long time, the car actually works right away. Right off the bat. Okay, let's just double check that. I need to forget something here. Because, you know, super excitement can cause these things. And you guys know, simple things, pleasures me very, very much. All right, I think we're good. Good thing is we can drive back home, but again, we'll have to be careful of that area. We were all the way here and dropping off some stuff over there. Um, probably a good idea. We are pretty full of loot. I don't think cars are on this thing, but that looks... That looks Get on so we can drive. All right, guys, we're going to leave the episode here. I know it sucks because a lot of you are like, oh, God, he got the car. Okay, next episode, I'll try and get them out, all right, as fast as we can. If you guys are enjoying this, please make sure you hit the like button. If you're brand new, please go ahead and subscribe. And tell me that's not the coolest freaking vehicle you've seen. That is absolutely awesome. I'm loving it. All right, thank you again, guys. You guys are the best. This is Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.